What do you do if you want an all-wheel drive hybrid Ford Maverick? Well, it's going to come for 2025. Uh, it was in the original planning, so I'm sure it's I'm sure it's coming down. The original planning for the Maverick was to create a very affordable a vehicle vehicle that can basically help almost anyone out. Whether you're 75 years old or 25 years old, it's made to help everyone out. The Ford Maverick, price-wise. It's one of the most fuel efficient vehicles on the market and it's the best priced vehicle on the market. When you look also at its fuel efficiency and its resale value, this thing when you calculate inflation into the vehicle is less than an original Ford Model T. And the Ford Model T helped bring workers and people to their jobs, make money and also well, Henry Ford invented the weekend so that families could get out, spend time together and also have a reason to buy a vehicle. <laughs> so now a lot of us work further away from work and uh, we work, sorry, our jobs are further away from our homes and we need a vehicle just to bring us to work. And I'm not for the idea of having some great joy. I think it was a sick joke, uh, certain politician she was saying that uh, we'll all be, you know, happy driving buses because buses will be electric and have USB ports and we'll be able to play on our phones and won't that be wonderful? No. If you take away my home and you take away my vehicle and I have to rent my ride via a bus and to get to work just to go work for someone else's joy. No, I'm, I, and take my home away, which is my source of generating wealth. I'm, I'm not going to be happy. So I thought it was a sick, out of touch joyce, a jo a joke. So Camilla missed on that one. So Lily had to go kick the can because if that happens, that'll be the only game we'll be able to and toy we'll be able to <laughs> afford for her. So the all wheel drive is a fantastic vehicle. But I still recommend you order one right now. And if you currently have an order, keep your order. So if you want an all-wheel drive hybrid, don't wait to order for 2025 order banks because they're kind of not going to be available. I think a lot, there'll be some, I think there'll be maybe some carryover 2024 hybrid orders and some very eager people that are going to be right on day one ordering up an all-wheel drive hybrid Maverick. This thing is going to be unbelievably popular. This is going to reignite popularity because I can tell you year one at my dealer, we didn't have day one, all sorts of Maverick orders. They happened over several months. It didn't sell out super quick, but in the States, 2023 20, Ford Maverick orders sold out in five days. There's gonna be quite possibly some carryover front wheel drive hybrid orders. I think all the EcoBoost, if you've ordered an EcoBoost, you're getting a 2024 Ford Maverick EcoBoost, but if you are wanting an all-wheel drive hybrid, put in your order now. Be one of those people that converts over. Make sure you get a signed build order. Make sure you get a confirmed, signed by them, purchase order or lease, uh, sorry, purchase offer or lease offer. Get their signature on it to lock in that price in case you get a 2023. But if you don't want a 2023 because it's front wheel drive, here's the trick. Add all the things I've been telling you not to add. Add protective paint, uh, uh, add the clear protective wrap. Throw on, wh why not? Throw in a bed liner, Th add everything. All the plastic stuff. Eh? You say add that. everything. And also tell your dealer, I'm adding everything because really I wanna have, I wanna be first in line for uh, 2025. So add all those things, add the mud flap, which is gonna slow down your order likely, add the bed liner. Luxury package shouldn't be much of an issue slowing things down, but putting in a hybrid order will slow things down. Now, if you put in an EcoBoost order and you add everything, it quite probably almost certainly will get built anyways, but as a very late EcoBoost order. So watch out, uh, order an EcoBoost. If you want an EcoBoost, I think the two liter turbo is a fantastic powertrain. I love the 250 horsepower and 280 pound feet of torque. For the weight of the vehicle, roughly 36, 3,700 pounds. It's an absolute blast to drive. So there's your tricks for getting a 2025 all-wheel drive hybrid Ford Maverick. Order one up now, throw, take it all dress, the full menu, the, that clear wrap, 
and that roll up uh, roll up let's say a roll up uh, tonneau cover with mud flaps maybe throw on some deflectors in there and it'll be real hard to make but also mention it to your <laughs> dealership in case that they in case they can put in an order code that'll make sure it doesn't get order uh, created this year you can see if they've got an, uh, a capability of throwing on a priority code to make sure it does not get built